going slowly. It's not. Oh. Yes, sir. We finish off the sort of very informal mock test. Yep. The first lesson. Nice good trip line spot checks. Without jinxing it, perhaps we've beat the rain. Ah, uh, this is a question I meant to ask. For the speed bumps, what is the appropriate amount of braking or speed? A uh, turning clock. Hello. Is it all one way, or...? Um, that's a very good question. No. Yeah. It's not a one way. At the end of the road, turn right. It's not a one way. It's not... Oh. oh. Just in case, because if a car does come in, we're going to be... Okay. ...on this side of the road. One way road. It will have these double double lines all the way across. Yeah. Can you see how where the middle line is it separates and it becomes a single line? Got it. Single lines are where people will drive in and double lines are. Yes, sir. Would you put up on the right again for me? Anywhere is fine. This is actually one of the maneuvers, so I'm trying to recreate like a real driving test. What we're going to do next is just reverse back a couple of car lengths. Got it. And try to finish a little bit closer to the pavement. Okay. So when you're ready, if you just go into a reverse, that should help us. Ideally, we want to finish in a position where the yellow line would be resting on the edge. Got it. Okay. Use all the space you need. Take all the time. No rush. Make sure it's safe before we reverse. And then when you're ready, we'll just back.
Let's watch this again. Very good. So just for the manoeuvres, because this is sort of, I should mention for anyone watching, this is our first lesson, you've never driven yep. this car before, it's the first day. Um, for manoeuvres, uh, well done with your observations at the beginning, well done for your observations in the middle, and then we'll just do another little observation at the end. This is fine by the way, I'm happy to stop here, so thank you, take your time. Well, when you're ready, drive on. Nice blind spot check again, brilliant. I remember a little bit earlier when we were practicing, yep. uh, you asked a question about always signaling when pulling up. Always signal when pulling out. Yeah, it's not a major because yep. again, no one there. Yeah. They've uh, already it, passed. So. It's the, got it. Yeah. Muscle memory. Yeah, it's just, you just always do something, right? And it's a good habit, safe habit. Sorry. Who's this Gordon guy? Gordon Ryan? Yeah. Is he, how old is he? He is young. No. Oh, he is well, about 40. So. No, no, he's not 40, oh, he's, okay. he, he does look old. He does. So, so my colleague was actually... Me. Uh, I was actually at that competition. Okay. Oh, uh, I, I was coaching. Recent one. Cool. Yeah, so I was, that, I was in Vegas for that one. Whoa, that's so cool. My uh, colleague Owen was on that show. Owen, is he... Owen Jones. Is he the other famous guy? Uh, that's, that's Craig Jones. All right, okay. But Owen and Owen uh, had a really good day one. How many days was the competition? Day two. two. So he, right. he submitted the first two guys in pretty spectacular fashion in the first day. Uh, and then he got uh, caught in a footlock on day two. At the end of the road, turning right. Good with your positioning this time because this is a one way road. I'm gonna wait for him. Sure. So here we have while we're waiting, just to show you the double double lines. Can you see they're all the way yep. across the road? So one way. Nice observations, very good. That is a bus line. Yes, big solid line. Different from the jagged line that you said. Good way to identify the bus line. towards the sign here and it says in circular should we I'm sorry it says in circular both ways Enfield Edmonton yep. if you could try to follow the sign to Enfield
Okay, actually, show me, tell me question time. With the power steering, how would you test to see it's working? Uh, to see if there was a power steering failing light. Oh, the light? Hmm. I don't know if there is a light for the power uh, steering, not... actually. Oh, uh, if the steering feels light. Yes, perfect. Show me question. Let me show you one now. You see this twisty bit here? Yep. I twisted it all the way. Yes. That's the dipped beam headlights. Yes. Just give it a little twist while we're here at the traffic light all the way. Yep. And then back again all the way down the way. Fantastic. So we turned them on and then we turned them off. Later, that's the dipped beam headlights. Yes. I'll ask us to do that while we're driving. Okay. okay. We'll do that a bit later. That's called the show me question. For some reason, I'd have thought the, the, the high beams would be at the You'd end of correct. the stick. You'd be correct, yes. I, I will fill in some gaps, but yes, you are correct. For everyone at home, this is um, an informal mock test. You guys won't be able to see this. But you see that stop line? Yes. There? Trying to just be before. Yeah, I, that was indecisive from me because I was, I was thought I was gonna follow, but then the light went amber and the traffic was semi at a standstill in the box. So I thought... Safer to wait here. Safer to wait yeah, here. Yeah, you'd be correct. It is safer to wait here. But give you a general for cost. This is quite a big one. Yeah. But generally only two cars in the middle. Yeah. Third car here. Got it. This is a bit bigger, so you might get three cars in there. Yeah. But generally two, third car wait here. So that could help in future. And if we get wood green, this would be one of the crossroads you could do. trying to turn right at the traffic lights. I went early, right? Uh, moving into the junction? Is that what you meant by As early? in, uh, probably my, well definitely my mistake, uh, but I didn't think I could have turned right at that point. Was that, was that wrong? Uh, do you remember earlier when we had the cars in the junction? Yes. They stopped? Yes. So we just needed to stop? Okay. And then once we have a gap, no cars are coming. Got it. Like that. You see how they're there? Yes. Let's try here. Turning right the traffic lights. It's nice we've got an arrow actually. So you see yeah. the arrow? We're aiming to stop on top of our arrow for that little right. Great. Love it when they put some nice road markings. It's a little bit rare in this country. I'm sure Atlanta will be better. I'm jealous. I want to move as well. Just waiting for my kids to grow up. Once they're old enough, maybe I'll go back. Yeah, that was also kind of in the um, the thought process. We're like, we're going to do it. Kind of got to go now. Yes, yeah, you're right. Okay, so just slowly, like walking speed, just creep into the junction and go stop on top of that arrow. Oh, brilliant. If there's no vehicles, then we can just continue to turn.
lovely and good dominating. Now that you're here, this is yeah. all for you, dominating that middle section. It does seem like you have priority actually, not that we had any signs, but yeah. you see the giveaway lines, the oncoming traffic there. So this will be on test. Sorry to do this, it's my my fault. Yeah. Would you turn right here for me, please? Me talking too much, giving the lead direction. Okay, looks like we're going to follow the road round, so no need to signal, just a bit of a sharp bend, and we're just going to follow the road. Try to stay a little, yes, excellent, at least until we can see if there's any oncoming yeah. cars. Brilliant. Good with for speed. I'm trying to find somewhere to pull up, but it's so busy, I can't see any spaces. Yeah, I guess low and slow on a road with double park cars on either side. Yeah, I like that. I like the double park cars bit. That's a good saying. Yes, you'd be correct. So narrow, out, hard to see. Okay, I can see some very small gaps, but nothing major. Maybe after this grey car, you see there's a little bit of a driveway there on the left. Yep. Let me just pull up in front of the driveway. Try not to go on the driveway, but just somewhere in front. We're only going to be a second. It looks like there's a bit more room actually. Okay, so if we just edge up to the other driveway, it's just a bit further down. That one seems to be for a block of flats, so it might be a bit busier. Yeah, and then anywhere here on the left would be absolutely fine. Thank you. And on the driving test, sometimes the examiners will say that, don't worry about the driveway, you can stop in front of the driveway. Okay. All right, um, what we're going to do now is independent driving, just to finish off the route. So we have a sat nav here. Yeah. I don't think it's actually going to say anything, but I'm going to turn the sound on. Got it. If it doesn't, I might just have to pretend I'm a sat nav. You've got a good sat nav voice. <laughs> yeah. Um, I put the sound on, it didn't seem to... Oh, there we go. All right, so we'll see what happens. Um, otherwise, I might just say left or right. But otherwise, when you're ready and it's safe, drive on and follow the sound now. So it doesn't seem to be saying anything, so at the end of the road, turn left. Things I've seen you really progress with today, mirror checks, yeah. now is just a very good example of that, lots of mirror checks there. And then the blind spot checks actually, so as you're moving away and reversing, you're starting to really do the shoulder checks, so yeah. you know, so well done. Continue to keep that practice going. I said it before, so sorry to bore you, but it's about 50% of the driving test as you mirror check and observation. So. Very large percentage.
Very good distance, that's the required distance. Go over the line, that's okay. Well done, that was a nice overtake for the bicycle there. Yeah, I think we're actually on a 30 road now, aren't we? It's been a lot of 20s, so you could use a little extra speed there, probably to when you were overtaken, especially. Yeah. So when you get the gap, just using that speed to get past a bit quicker. question. Now the examiners start the question by saying when it's safe. That means you take all the time you need to do whatever you choose. So when it's safe, I'd like to show us how you turn on the dipped beam headlights. Too sure if we were aware, uh, our, our lane was right turning only. Yeah, I <laughs> the bus driver's like, What the hell? He's waving his hands back there. Yeah, but it was quite nice. He let you in. I think you used your mirrors there as yeah. well. You saw the gap. Yeah, uh, for the driving test, we've got to avoid that. Yeah, real life, you know, yeah, you shouldn't be saying stuff like this. Real life's different to driving yeah. to what I'm trying to say. I, I I was slightly confused because the Prius in front of me was conf was you saw signaling that. left. Oh, okay. you saw that as well. Yeah, yeah. nice, good. So Little clues. I I was I was gonna ask, but I definitely can't ask the driver. Can. Oh, yeah, I can. can. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, if it's to do with direction, yeah, I would encourage to ask. So that's fine. Um, if you find yourself in a position where you can't change lanes, it's not safe, you're allowed to still turn right and you will pass. Yes. So it doesn't mean if you go a different direction that you're going to get marked down. You won't. Got it. As long as you go a different direction safely, 100%. Fine. Where are we? Wood Green. Yeah, we're, yeah. we're in Wood Green proper now. Okay. That's the station. That's the tube station. All right.
This is cool. Never been here before. For you, you're like, yeah, I've been in a million times before. It's <laughs> my first. Very right, please. Dominating, turning white at traffic lights. Good mirrors. Thank you. Uh, there may be. Okay, so it's just before the traffic light. There's a little side left road. You yep. see the silver Mercedes. Mm -hmm. So if you just take the next left please just before the traffic light. Right. One thing that really threw me off when I was learning to drive these lines. Yeah. I always, maybe my OCD or something like that. Yeah. I always wanted to be inside them. Yes. You can cut over them. For the test as well, you can cut over them. I'm not saying to do it here, by the way, yeah. but I'm just going to give a little example. Maybe not so much here, but maybe at the next one of these things here yeah. when there's less cars coming. Yeah, that's it. Now, that's the example I was going to give actually. Yeah. You've moved out a bit earlier. Yes. Which means we're not following the lines. We might go over the line because we're moving out earlier, like earlier than that. Yeah. So it might put us a bit out. <laughs> yeah. Um, but that's better. Also, park cars. So imagine that curb. You yeah. Know, the one we've got on the left. That thing with the yellow sign is in the blue circle yeah that it's difficult here because they're going to be there right yeah. but yeah i think you're getting it so you're moving out yeah here. just more um just a little tiny bit yeah that's all Priority, yeah, good confidence. Nice steering as well, already sort of feeling it out. Yeah, minutes there was no pain. <sighs> yes, this won't be in the video. <laughs> no, no, put it in the video. <laughs> this camera stops, so uh, okay, it'd just be our faces. I think I can point to my majors. Yep, go on in. Uh, the guy at the crosswalk I missed, yes. So that would have been a major. Mm -hmm. uh, I would the uh, me being in the wrong lane. Yes. That's a major. Yes. Only if you don't go the way that lane says to go. Got it. Yeah. Then so if I go the way the lane says to go, but I go but I go in the wrong direction Correct. to the yeah. That's a major. That's no. It's nothing. 
Well, no, no, as in what I did was major, but if Correct. I. Correct. Yeah, got disobeying it. road markings. Yes. The faults were done on the move. Yeah, right. There's someone there now. Uh, right, let's come out here. 